Community colleges can often provide a cheap and flexible option when it comes to a student's education. However, institutions are being met with an expensive problem. Financial aid, how can I help? These schools are feeling the pains of financial aid fraud, where scammers submit fraudulent applications under stolen identities. The attempts that we're seeing are students that are submitting uh, fraudulent stolen identities, uh, fraudulent information on the FAFSA, and they're attempting to enroll in classes to receive uh, federal grant funds uh, and then drop classes. These scammers are called Pell Runners as they collect Pell Grants from the federal government and then run off with the money. The California Community College's Chancellor's Office has reported a total of $5 million given to these scammers alone. These fraudsters particularly target online courses where it's harder to tell if you're a real human being or not. And these classes suspiciously fail to capacity. But by the time the course begins, all of these scammers vanish and what's left behind are very few well-intentioned students. This is a costly problem, but the solution? We require uh, suspected fraudulent applicants to come to campus in person and submit a photo identification so that we can verify their identity and allow them to move forward through the application process. According to COC Financial Aid, the amount of fraudulent applications that come through measure at around 2 to 3 percent. While a small number, the impact is significant enough to require immediate action. For Canyons News, I'm Christian Sukic.